Villa Anita is a project set on the southeastern tip of Death Valley, California. One of the hottest places in the world. It started simply as a way to make the desert bearable year-round. It's become a two-acre obsession. Villa Anita has become an extension of my work because the building is imbued with the same value system as my art, creating a feedback loop between my life and my work, the division of which has become very blurry. Villa Anita has given me a chance to work on a grander scale. and a venue to showcase my ever-growing body of paintings and sculpture. The expansive labyrinth of sculptural rooms and indoor-outdoor vignettes encircle a house that was finished in 1951 by a mine architect named Robert Blake, who in 1956 and 57 helped Richard Neutra finish the Sorrells family home just 10 miles from Tacopa in Shoshone, California. The Blake home is built almost exclusively with repurposed railroad ties and local stone. It took me four years of working on Villa Anita to realize that my obsession is more likely a possession by the Blake spirit. Like his original home, the spaces I've added are built almost entirely from repurposed material. Out here in the desert, you're faced with the accumulation of your life. Which presents a unique opportunity for your life to become the media you transform into art. And your art kind of grows with your life. And the art kind of informs how you live. Out here, you really get to see how you are responsible for everything that comes into your life. The desert is the end of the line, so you have to decide where things will end up. For instance, you buy beer from the store, you drink the beer, now you have 12 bottles and a cardboard box. What do you do with that? Throw it out into the desert? Maybe, but dealing with this decision every day makes you realize that every detail in your life has this sort of cause and effect. You are how you usher things to their next destination. It's that sort of awareness that I'm cultivating here. I'm cultivating an experience. where people see life as art. Not only do they see it, but they participate in it. They live it.
and they experience the peace that comes with it, the humanity that comes with it. Villa Anita is stepping forward from America's past century of paring down art to its base. What's basic to art is the human experience, passing on a legacy. Villa Anita is the future of American art.